What's up everybody? Canuck Shaver here. I'm here today to talk to you about a company, Barbary Coast, uh, makers of these two amazing products. Um, first, the uh, Havana Aftershave Balm, and secondly, the Barbary Coast Bay Rum Aftershave number 28. Um, both absolutely top notch. Everything about them, from the packaging to the quality of the product inside the bottles, Everything about Barbary Coast is top notch in my opinion. Love this stuff. I've been using this stuff, I think, for over a year now. Both of them are my top, top bomb, top aftershave, right up there in my top three to five, easily. Amazing stuff. First one I want to talk about is we'll talk about the Havana aftershave bomb. Havana, when you think of Havana, you think of Cuban cigars, and that's pretty much what you get with this. It is a beautiful tobacco scent. Sweet, it's got coffee notes, some cocoa, um, and a little bit of vanilla as well. And there's some uh, clove as well, but it's not that. If you don't like clove, you don't have to worry about it. I don't find the clove really stands out at all. It doesn't affect the scent. Um, just to let you know that it is in there. Um, just a beautiful scent. And there's also a slight menthol kick to it, which is great because you can wear this in the summer. I do wear bombs in the summer, but they don't tend to be like scent profiles like vanilla and tobacco, usually they're lime. But this one you can't because it does have that little menthol kick to refresh your skin a little bit. Um, but it's not enough that where if you put it on the winter, you're going to be, oh, I don't want menthol in the winter because it's already cold enough outside. Great stuff. It, and the best part of it is the actual performance of this stuff is outstanding. The scent lingers for a while, maybe up to a couple of hours. Um, not super strong. But... The performance, it just, it moisturizes your skin, but it absorbs quickly too, so you know, it doesn't leave your skin oily, which you don't want from a bomb, which I th think that's why people avoid bombs in the summer, because it makes your skin conditions oily and heavy. This does not do that. This is absolutely top-notch stuff. I love it. Just one of the best smelling bombs easily on the market. And I'm a bomb guy, so I've tried quite a few, and this one is right up there. Pairs awesome with any vanilla soaps, any tobacco soaps. It actually pairs well with Spice Balm, um, EDT, any of those with tobacco vanilla, anything like that. It's going to go well with it because it's not strong enough. It's going to overpower it. It'll just add to it. Gorgeous stuff. Next up, I'm going to talk about Barbary Coast Bay Rum Aftershave. This is the Bay Rum that got me into Bay Rums. I tried a Bay Rum early on in my wet shaving and I didn't really like it. wasn't a big fan. Got a bottle of this and I absolutely love Bay Rum now. All year round. I just love it. Cinnamon, allspice, bay, um, clove. There's also the great part about this. It smells like a typical Bay Rum quite a bit. It's got that DNA of a great Bay Rum but it also has some hints of citrus and a little tiny hint of vanilla which is unique to this Bay Rum which I haven't smelled in any other ones and it works so well. Um, I actually just put some of this stuff on this morning, splashed a little bit more on in this, this afternoon because it is. it just smells fantastic. It smells classy, um, yet yeah, rugged, masculine. Um, yes, it's all on my hands and you can smell that. You get a little bit, after you put, when you first put it on, you get the classic Bay Rum. Then after a few, couple minutes, when it starts drying down, you get the citrus comes out and the vanilla hints come out and it's beautiful. Again, pairs well with any kind of bay rum, colognes, or anything like that. Um, stands alone on its own. Again, you get a couple hours of performance out of it, what you get from a typical aftershave. Um, just fantastic products, guys. Um, can't say enough about them. The guys at Barbary Coast are amazing, too. I follow them on Instagram and Facebook. Um, they're always doing giveaways and stuff, so by all means, give them a follow, because they're always doing different stuff on there. Um, they also have a new Ascent, I believe it's called, and they have a lavender shave soap in the whole line. Both of these are also available in Aftershave. This one's also available in the Balm and soap, shaving soaps as well. So check that out. Again, uh, thanks for tuning in, guys. Um, hope to do some more uh, product reviews for you guys. I thought I'd done one on Barbary Coast a while ago. It turns out I haven't, and I really should have. So I apologize for that. So keep an eye out for more videos. Like and subscribe if you liked the video. Love hearing your comments down below, guys. Um, give me some suggestions of what else you'd like to see. Um, cheers. Have a good day. See you later.